Oh, man, it's about time you showed up. <sighs> well, you're looking awfully good for a corpse. So you brought the girl after all, huh? The girl? Hey, if it wasn't for her, you wouldn't be getting rescued right now. If this is a rescue... What the hell does that mean? You gotta admit, Sully, this all looks a little shady. Yeah. I mean, you tipping those guys off... And miraculously showing up alive? Now wait a goddamn minute. Roman had a contract out on me. I needed to buy some time. All right, stupid mistake. I didn't realize they'd try and track us. Sully, we would have been headed home with the treasure by now if you had just for once kept your mouth shut. And you might have thought of checking for a pulse before running off and leaving me for dead. Look, none of that matters now. All right, so how is it you're standing here breathing and all, huh? <laughs> you are not going to believe this. Huh? <laughs> no way. <laughs> Old Francis took a bullet for you. Yeah. I thought this kind of thing only happened in the movies. Yeah, well, it still hurt like a son of a bitch, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I bet. Anyway, once they realized I wasn't dead, I convinced Roman that they would never find the treasure without me. So I've been trying to mislead him ever since, waiting for you to show up. Well, where are they now? Well, they're chasing a little red herring I sent him on on the other side of the monastery to get rid of him. <laughs> Look. Drake had it all figured out. See, that's the symbol the Spanish use to mark their secret vaults. The treasure is hidden right here in this monastery. Find the symbol, and we, we find, find the vault. vault. We have everything we need right here. All the clues to take us right to the treasure. We can do this, kid. <laughs> all right, you boys aren't gonna get all chummy and leave the girl behind again, are you? <laughs> Don't even think about it, Sully. She's got a mean right hook. I'll keep that in mind. There's more to this room than meets the eye. I'm sure of it. Hmm. Something about these statues. Okay. That's not right. Another library? Huh. What now? You know, this looks familiar. The inverted torch leads to the land of the dead. Ah! <sighs> 
This looks promising. Here, let me see that? Yeah. Okay. You two sit tight. I'm gonna check things out. Whoa, wait, no. You're not going out there alone. Yeah, Roman's men are swarming all over this place. Yeah, and one person will make a lot less noise than three. Come on, I'll be fine. And you guys will be safe here. They don't even know about this room. Okay, take this with you. Leave it on channel 13. They don't use that one and keep us posted. All right, you got it. Close this thing back up. Yeah. Nate, be careful. <laughs> Come on, I always am. Ah, I did not see that. Ah. Okay, land of the dead. Here we go. That'll come in handy.
Oh, 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 don't! This could help. Wait, there's something about this. Two bells resound in perfect harmony. We got all the clues right here. We can do this, kid. How the hell does he think he's gonna get that statue out of here anyway? He's here! Grab him! Ah, oh, jeez, these guys are everywhere. Move up! Oh! Damn it. This is completely unacceptable. What do you expect from me, Roman? My men are getting massacred! <laughs> I find it hard to believe that one man could wipe out your entire crew. Ugh, it's not just Drake, goddammit! I'm telling you, this island is cursed! Enough. Take your sorry mob and go. Wait. 
Wait, you can't cut me loose. You owe me a share of the gold! Your share, Eddie, was contingent upon you doing what I required. You assured me that Drake was captured and the island secure. Oh, this is bullshit, Roman, and you know it! We are done here, Mr. Roger. Dai Kamu! Matia Jello! Sielen! Remind me again why you employed that superstitious idiot? You wanted someone cheap. <laughs> well, you get what you pay for, I suppose. And what about you, Navarro? Are you worth what I'm paying you? The vault's here. I'm sure of it. If Sullivan can be trusted. Which he can't. Look, he knows we'll kill him if he's lying. Don't be stupid, he knows we'll kill him once we find the treasure. He has no incentive to tell the truth. Really, Navarro, sometimes I think you left your brains back in that slum where I found you. I just need a little more time. Chasing this treasure of yours is proving to be more trouble than it's probably worth. I assure you, El Dorado is worth more than you can possibly imagine. <laughs> It had better be.